Bust down. Bust down, Tatiana. Bust down, Tatiana. I wanna see you bust down. Over. Pick it up, not break that shit. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is gonna be a recreation of what I got done for me on my engagement day. I had the beautiful and talented Makeup by Nelly do my makeup and snatch me, girl. I wasn't ready, okay? I wasn't ready to be that snatched. And if you guys want to see how freaking gold goddess I was, check out my Instagram and you will know exactly what I'm talking about. I love the look so much that I was like, shit, I'm gonna recreate it myself and give it a little bit of a twist to it using her beautiful lashes that she custom made. Um, yeah, girl, that's the only thing I didn't do myself. If you guys don't already know, I upload every single week, every single week. Look out for a video every single week. Hey, hey. Hey, if you guys can't already tell, dun, 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 I hit a thousand subscribers on my channel. Shout out to Ruse, thanks for the balloons and the cupcakes. You are the sweetest. I hit a thousand freaking subscribers on this YouTube channel and I'm so freaking happy. I can't thank you guys enough for how much support and love you guys give me. This is just my starting stepping stone to what I'm gonna achieve later in the future bitch but without further ado let's get started it is a rainy day in la i went blonder so i had to lighten up my brows a little bit so i want to shade lower lower so i had my engagement party for those of you who don't know i am engaged and i had my engagement party last weekend and my makeup girl it looked so freaking good it was the first time I ever got it done by someone else because I'm extra picky, so I don't like everyone's work. And when I found makeup by Nelly, I was like, I like her style. So I went and got it done by her and oh my God, she slayed my face. Like, oh my God, you guys have to see the freaking pictures on my Instagram. Don't forget to check me out on Instagram. You'll know what pictures I'm talking about when you come across it. I look like a freaking golden goddess. Oh my God. And I got a spray tan, which FYI, one of the best decisions I've ever made in my life. So I thought, why not just recreate the look? We'll see if I can achieve something close to what she came up with. I'm gonna pick up the Minimalist Palette by LC Cosmetics. And I'm gonna go into this shade right here. I'm just going to blend that all over. Now I'm gonna pick up a different brush. This is my M433. And I'm gonna pick up this orangey shade right here. I'm gonna blend that right in the crease. I freaking miss doing makeup tutorials. I swear I've been all over the place with this channel because I have so many different ideas, but it's always so good to Go back to your roots where you started from. I'm gonna go back into my E27 and just blend this all out. I still can't get over that makeup look. My freaking hair and makeup, phenomenal. You guys will see some pictures from my engagement too if you follow me on Instagram. It was a good time. Now I'm gonna go into this brown just a little bit, just a touch. I don't want too much brown. And I'm going to go in with a very light hand right on top of that orange. And then using my M507, I'm gonna go into a touch of this black and kind of start smoking out like a liner using shadow. Now two things, I know that my lid was super gold. So I'm gonna go into my Kit and Karma by Stila. It's not a gold gold, it has a little bit of pink in it. So to cover up that pink, I'm gonna go into the Lucky Star Duo by Dose of Colors. So when it's still wet, I'm gonna use the glitter right on top. Kind of like the wetness will give it a glue effect so it could stick right on. So we gotta work fast. I'm gonna go back into the black and just add some right on top. And then I'm gonna go a little bit into that brown. All right guys, so I have my lashes on. These are the lashes that she uh, made for me. And what I mean by that is she literally custom made them on me and I freaking love them. They're so extra. I usually never show you guys how I do my face, but today I'll make it an exception. 
since we're celebrating, you know. Put on some primer. This is my Smashbox primerizer. And then I'm gonna take my Porefessional by Benefit and just apply this on my T-zone. I'm gonna pick up my favorite Lancome uh, foundation. I'm gonna mix it with this Fenty Beauty. Just got a brand new shape tape from Ulta. Now I'm gonna go ahead and set my face. Then I'm gonna begin my contouring. This is the Benefit Hula Quick Stick. I'm gonna add some highlight to this. Now I'm going to pick up my LC bronzer in medium. Now I'm going to bake for a quick minute until we move on to under the eyes. I'm going to go into my Tarte clay pot. I'm not too like big of a fan of this one, but it's the only one I have right now. I'm going to add this in my waterline and my tight line. Now with an angled brush, I'm gonna go into this dark brown color and I'm just going to line that right underneath. Attach what we have going on and line. And then I'm gonna go a little bit into the black and go really close to my lash line. Picking up a pencil brush, I'm gonna go into the brown shade one more time and just blend what we have going on underneath. And I'm gonna go a touch into this orange too. Now I'm going to add some mascara to wrap this all up. I'm going to go into my MAC Desert Rose and just add a little bit of color to my face. Not too much because I love the bronzy look. I'm going to go into my favorite highlighter ever. This is the Anastasia Amrisi highlighter. I'm going to pop some in my brow bone and some in my inner corner. I'm gonna use my Tatcha Luminous Silk Mist. I am going to just add some right here. Just the points right I'm gonna highlight. Oof. I went ahead and changed my shirt because I got some highlight moments going on over here in my picture. So I'm gonna go ahead and just add some highlight on my collarbones. Who uses their self? as inspiration i do for lips i'm gonna go into boldly bare by mac i was gonna go into strip down but i literally don't know where it is like i just had it and for the lipstick i am using bow and arrow by kat von d i always forget my nose highlight like it's the last last little touch that you should put on your face and I forget and then I'm gonna go into this little tester I have it's called made in Italy number 40 by Sephora and I'm just gonna add this right in the middle just to give it a little bit of a brighter look all right guys this is my finished look on my recreation of the engagement look thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like share comment and of course don't forget to subscribe to stay up to date with all my latest videos. Thank you guys so much for tuning in and I will see you guys next time. Bye guys.